everyone, DC Eric here, and today I have another awesome video to show you. That's for Hermes for the Sega Dreamcast, which was created by the Retro Guru team. Now, if you don't know who Retro Guru is, they are uh, the developer for a number of awesome games that have already been released on the Dreamcast and other platforms. Now, the games, of course, are Fruity, Gianna's Return, Squares 1, 2, 3, and 4, Zump 1, and Zump 2. Two. Now, currently, Zump 2 is only available for the Sega Genesis. We do hope to see that that game gets developed for other platforms as well. Now, currently, the game for the Dreamcast is only available on physical, and you'll be able to buy that in the link at the description below. Now, if you prefer to play the game on a different platform, you'll be able to get it at, again, in the link in the description below. Now, of course... What's cool about the physical copy is included, you'll get the soundtrack, you'll get a physical of the comic book itself, and of course on the disc, you will get ports for the other consoles, and of course, you will get a digital copy of the comic book itself. So what's cool about that? Everything! You get a cool game, you get a soundtrack, you get a comic book, and you also get the ports for other consoles right on this disc. So... Why don't we check out the game right now? Alright, okay, so here's Hermes, the main screen for the Sega Dreamcast version. And it should be the same for all the other consoles as well. Now it's pretty simple and clear of what we gotta do here, and let's press the start button. Okay, so the main menu is you got new game, continue, high scores, and options. In the options, of course, you can configure the keys, which is not needed for the Dreamcast version. It's already configured to uh, work pretty well. Well, actually, it looks like you can configure the pad if you really want to. Press start for the start button. Left, right, up, down, and jump. Okay, pretty simple. There's music, sound effects, Use up to jump. Yeah, I don't like that, so I'm going to keep that off. Sound check, slasher. Okay, so you can check out the sounds in there as well. Now you can reset the default if you found the settings are not correct to your taking. Uh, so we're just going to keep it the way it is. Alright, so we're going to check out how to play this awesome new game. Okay, so it looks like um, this guy here has to... He looks like he's got a chance after a chicken. Okay, so I heard that this game can be pretty difficult. You got three men, and you're supposed to make sure you don't overeat. Okay, so now there's bathrooms in different spots located in the game. And, like I said, just make sure that you do not overeat. So it's pretty much like a, a Mario sort of game, uh, well, a little different, uh, you don't, you gotta eat food. And that down there is a porcupine, so you don't want to jump on them. Here's a turtle, and yes, like the, uh, su or sorry, uh, Super Mario Bros, the turtle actually comes back alive. So, just, just be aware of that. Okay, so we're eating uh, what looks like to be donuts. Oh, I'm not 100% sure if that is. Okay. Oh, okay. So, yeah, this looks like donuts. So you got to be careful on how much you eat. So... Oh! Oh, okay. So don't go under platforms when they're coming down. Or, uh, yeah, you're, you're going get, to get killed. So you can go and swim, but remember to make sure you have enough breath to uh, get to the end. Okay, so there's that uh, platform there. And uh, don't go under it or you'll get killed. Okay, so there's some donuts. And that looks like a potion of some sort. We'll go back into the bathroom stall. And some more potions. And there we go. The, the level is done. So no meat in this level as far as I can tell. Now I guess there's uh, some secrets in this game as well. I'm not really uh, too sure where they all are located in this uh, game. 
but if you check out on YouTube, there's probably people who've been playing this game professionally. So you'll be able to find out where the secrets are located. Now, I, I could have found a secret here, but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so... Oh! Looks like I ate too much. Darn. Okay, so I did have that warning. Gotta be careful. Anytime you eat too much food, use the toilet. Okay, so... Once you get the warning, just make sure you get to the bathroom as soon as possible. I got one more life here. Now, the cool thing about this game is that there is unlimited continues. Okay, so now, uh... Make sure I get to the bathroom. So yes, there's unlimited continues, so you can start right off where you left. I'm gonna make sure my hunger gets down a little bit. And no, oh, okay. I guess I gotta digest my food somehow. Okay, so I have to get to the bathroom in order to eat more food. It doesn't matter how much hunger I have. I gotta digest that food, and it's gotta go into a toilet. So. I failed that one, but we are going to continue off. I'm going to continue. You just press left on the screen and it will automatically uh, start where you have left off in the game. Okay. So, we're going to get that there. Okay, so now i got to get to a toilet. So we're going to ignore those donuts there. And... Shoot. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh, no! Okay, so you know what? I'm going to ignore those, uh, those extra points there at the bottom. If you eat too many of those, then you will not be able to complete this, this level. Now, the funny thing is, I, I have a pretty good uh, friendship with... Uh, the, the main guy behind this, and that is Shazad, and, uh, or I guess it's Shazad. No, sorry if I got your name wrong, I'm sure you're gonna give me trouble for that. Now, uh, sorry, I got dogs, so they're gonna be making some noise every once in a while, but anyways, yes, I talked to Shazad, and, uh, he tells me that this game is gonna be a lot easier than the other ones, that meaning games like Squares, which is really hard for me. And, uh, we'll see, uh, oh boy. We'll see if I can actually, uh, oh, oh, oh! Okay, so those are, those platforms break. So far I'm finding this game to be pretty difficult. You were wrong, I think you were tricking me. Anyways, it's kind of fun, I really, uh, love these strategic, uh, sort of games. And, uh... I'd love to see if I can actually beat this level, so... We're just gonna finish this off here, and if I can get to the next level... I might do that. Okay, so we're just going to skip a few here and there. You don't want to eat too much, and you want to be able to, uh... to get past the level, so... So only eat as much as you can and make sure you'll have enough to uh, to get to the next toilet. Oh, oh, and there's a toilet. Yay, we made it. Oh, oh, wow. Gotta watch out for that foot. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I got blocked in. Oh, you tricked me. Okay, so... Yeah, that looked like a foot, but it could have been something else, so I'm not really too sure. <laughs> okay, so... Um, okay, remember not to eat too much. Anyways, it uh, looks like they have checkpoints in this game as well, so that's kind of helpful. Okay, a bunch of enemies that we can jump on. And we have beat the second level. Now I got two more men left. So we're going to check to see if I can actually beat the next level. And, uh... 
finish this off as soon as I get game over. How about that? Oh, 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 oh! Oh, they take the hunger away. It can be helpful in sorts. Alright, so we got that turtle. Oh! Well, that was a good timing anyways. Okay. Okay, so how much breath we have left here? Just keep going. Oh, we got hit. Okay, so we're gonna see if I can get that extra man again. And oh, it's, I'm just not too good at that jump there. Should be pretty simple. All right. Do 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 do. Wow, they they do a really good job of uh, making the levels. That's for sure. He's got some really good ideas and plans behind this, so I really like what they do here. Oh. Okay, so uh, gotta get to the bathroom. Excellent. I made it. So the food is good for points, but can also kill you. Very uh, good planning. Level planning in that. Level development. Whatever you want to call it. Okay, so. Got some food. Alright, excellent. And no meat. No meat for me. Chicken is too fast for me. Alright. So you gotta watch out for this uh, porcupine here. Du -du 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 -du. I guess there is no meat in this game. I, could, I guess I'm wrong, so... I know that the chicken is meat, but uh, I don't think there is any real way of... of uh, actually collecting it. I guess you might have to be faster, I'm not 100% sure. Okay. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to kill myself because I can't make that jump. Okay, so we're on my last man here. And... Just gotta make sure that we can... Oh! Get this. Let's see if we can get that jump. Ah. Oh. Can't. I'm watching for the spikes. Perfect. See, I'm just gonna limit myself on uh, on how much I eat. And I'm sure there's there's people who are are making the uh, their scores higher. So here here's the checkpoint. That's good to know. So as soon as you hit that little arrow there, when you die, you, uh, you will be put right back where, where that checkpoint is. That's excellent. Goodbye! And I have zero hunger, so maybe I should have ate a little bit more. Okay, so this is Hermes for the Sega Dreamcast. I gotta say, it's actually pretty fun. It's strategic. You gotta make sure that you're eating enough food, and if you're not eating enough food, you will not be able to pass the level. As for getting the chicken, I think that's the uh, other strategic part of this game as well. And the main feature, I, I don't think you'll ever be able to catch the chicken, but I'm not 100% sure, because it is in the score thing. Um, so if you want to learn more a little bit about that, I would check out some other videos on YouTube. But uh, this is Hermes. It's a pretty fun, awesome game. I would recommend getting the physical copy again from the link below or even just downloading it for PC considering you might be watching this from PC or getting it for the phone because I do think it's on Android as well. Anyways, thanks for watching. This is has been a video brought to you by DC Eric and I hope to have a, a one again for you sometime in the near future. Thank you and goodbye.